Oh, man, it's absolutely huge. I mean, there's a lot of games that are big when you talk win-loss columns, but uh, when, it, when it comes to this game every year, uh, both teams might as well be 0-0 might as well be, uh, oh and oh, because you're going into this game like you're looking for win number one. And, uh, you know, if it's one team's really strong and the other's not, uh, it doesn't matter because even playing field for this game, uh, what's interesting about being a player and, and uh, specifically the, the meaning of this game for the UUP and the community is, uh, you know, we have guys on the team from, from all over the country. And uh, this week, it feels like everyone's from the UP. Like, we band together, and you want to win it for the local supporting community, uh, Houghton, uh, Hancock area, the, the staff and the faculty here. And you really want to you bring, bring that, uh, that trophy home and, and make sure that they have the bragging rights uh, across the UP for the next, the next year. So I don't know if there's anything different. The team really uh, trains uh, all year round to be ready for game week and uh, for game day uh, specifically. But there's certainly a, a clearer focus and more tenacity uh, when you walk in that field on game day and you see who your opponent is and the stands are packed and everyone's fired up and ready because it's, it is such a local rivalry. Uh, it's just classic uh, football rivalry uh, in the fall at its finest and uh, it should be a good one. I'm looking forward to it this week too. Yeah, absolutely. It's a great opportunity for me to come back and, uh, and see a lot of familiar faces, but also meet some of the new uh, student athletes and uh, understand, you know, better than anyone, I understand what kind of challenges they're, they're going through on a day-to-day -day basis, right? They got practice and meetings, working out, all their coursework, uh, homework, projects. Uh, I mean, they're, they're loaded down. And on top of it, uh, Traditionally, the athletes have ha always had some of the highest GPAs on campus. So you talk about someone that can and juggle a full workload, uh, also has a good head on their shoulders. Uh, they, they're a, obviously a team player. Uh, that, that's the kind of candidate uh, that, that works well for us in most companies. Um, so we know it's kind of a low risk when you get these guys that, you know, they know when the game's on the line, what they have to do to get it done. It, there's definitely some parallels there in the, in the corporate world. So uh, we've had a lot of luck with student athletes and uh, Michigan Tech students, I guess, as a whole, too. So.